So Gary Natali, congratulations on your honorary award tonight here at the Directors Guild. How does it feel? How honored are you? Well, thank you. I mean, I, I'm very honored. I'm honored to be able to basically being reg uh, bring recognition to our categories as stage manager associate directors are sort of the unsung heroes, I think, in the TV variety, live TV business. So. Live TV with a capital L. Yes. And uh, what were some of your, your most proudest moments from your, from your live TV career, if you had to whittle it down to just like a few? Well, the Oscar faux pas, the envelope situation, I think I uh, handled that pretty well and kind of uh, made uh, made that right, which could have gone very wrong if we didn't deal with that properly. <laughs> so uh, that's probably my top number one. Um, and uh, there's a lot of other ones that I don't think people would ever know because you never see the faults that happen on live television. We keep that, it away from the viewer. That means they're doing a girl doing a good job and that, keep it away. Right. Like I said, they, they, they pay us not for for doing necessarily a good job, but it's, they pay us for when things go wrong. Sure, that's right. Well, yeah. talk about something that went wrong that turned into something that went so right. So, Gary, I was in the audience watching the Oscars in 2017, and when when you know the three producers from La La Land were like saying thank you, thank you, I saw someone you know sitting in the first mezzanine. So I see someone run out like, wait, hang on, there's a problem, and. I was there. I was there in the moment and like what was happening and how everybody kind of recovered from that to turn the night into something really special. I mean, the thing is that I, I had to just fix it. My thing in my mind was like, okay, this is wrong. We can sit around and talk about it because the way communications is and everything in a TV truck, it, it's going to take minutes or just go in there and solve it. And that was just sort of my uh, first instinct. Get in there, find out what the issue, issue was and, and solve it. Find out it, it, where the right envelope is, was the wrong name uh, actually read off, etc. And that was my mission. And that's what I did. I remember when I was watching, you know, and again, I'm sitting watching the, the, the stage. I'm not watching the monitors because I'm like, I'm here. I want to watch, you know, Faye Dunaway and Warren Beatty. And I remember Warren was like kind of looking, you know, kind yeah. of stalling. And, and then, you know, like, like, did you think he was just kind of stalling or did you think like, uh oh, something's wrong? No, I, I thought he was just stalling because, you know, you had to be at rehearsal and rehearsal was sort of similar in a way. <laughs> so it was sort of like, okay, this is sort of their shtick that they're doing. So, no, I didn't think anything was wrong because it was just sort of like, ah, they're doing what they did. Right, right, right. But I got to say, you know, the way that, like, Jordan Horowitz came back, showed the envelope to the camera, like, he was such a class act. And also the way the producers and, of course, you know, the filmmakers from Moonlight came on and you had everybody from La La Land and everybody from Moonlight hugging each other. It turned into something really beautiful. No, I think it did. And I'm, I'm glad... We dealt with it while we were still on the air because we could have easily gone off the air without that being rectified. Oh boy, that would have been something else. Huh? Yeah, and can you imagine in the press afterwards, the next day, you know, uh, how, how do you come back from something like that? But also, I think, you know, the, the, the takeaway from that is that here are these two movies that are going to be always remembered because of it in a positive way yeah and that was on your watch thank <laughs> you yeah i mean yeah you no one's ever going to forget that oscars nope. ever you know it's going to go down in infamy so well congratulations on your presentation on your honor tonight thank it is so great to talk with you i'm a big oscar fan so keep keep going i'll try thank you very much really nice meeting you guys